998, 998, shot fire, shot fire. One subject running, stop out through the alley. Good evening, everyone. Tonight, Tempe police releasing the body cam footage showing an officer shooting a 14-year-old burglary suspect who later died at the hospital. It's our big story tonight. This deadly officer involved shooting of the young teenager sparking outrage in the community, even drawing protesters to the streets of Tempe looking for justice. Tonight, we're also hearing from the Tempe police chief about what could have caused this deadly shooting. Team Charles Bianca Bono has been tracking this story from the beginning. She's in Tempe for us tonight night with the latest Bianca. Guys, this is the alley near 48th Street and Vineyard where the deadly shooting took place. Family and friends of the teen have been demanding that the officer's body camera footage be released, and now we're getting our first look at it. We do want to warn you, some of you may find the images you're about to see disturbing. Let me see your hands. Video showing the moment a Tempe police officer shot a 14 year old burglary suspect Tuesday. Shot fire, one subject running, stop out through the alley. The teen was hit but kept running. He later died at the hospital. I must begin with expressing my deepest condolences to the young man's family. Tempe's police chief, who didn't take any questions, speaking out for the first time since the incident. It is our top priority to continue to provide professional police service and earn the trust of our community on every an interaction. The shooting starting with this 911 call. There's a truck back up to a backyard over here and looks like they're taking stuff out of the backyard. When the officer shows up, he finds 14-year-old Antonio Arce inside the truck, which didn't belong to him. Police releasing this still image from the body camera, showing the teen with an object that appears to be a weapon. The officer saw a suspect holding a handgun. The officer are seen hiding behind a trash can with his weapon drawn. Then the chase and gunshots. One subject down, one subject down. Police later realizing the object in the teen's hand, a replica airsoft gun, and he found it in the truck. The incident prompting outrage in the community. Tempe's police chief identifying the officer involved as Officer Hine, a 17 year veteran who also served in the military. He's now on administrative leave. I urge everyone to withhold judgment until the criminal and administrative investigations are concluded. And we did talk to the 14 year old's family as they were having a private vigil at their house. They tell me they have seen the video. We're in Tempe, Bianca Bono, 12 News. All right, Bianca, thanks. New